Lauren Hackett, outside hitter with the CBU women's volleyball team. Tell me about this match, Lauren. How would you kind of sum it up? Um, energetic. That was like the most energy we've ha ever had in the gym. We came out with a goal, and we accomplished that goal. Mm -hmm. uh, taking them in three was awesome, uh, especially after rough past past week was super rough, and so it was really great that everyone, like everyone, was super pumped. Every play, everyone was all in. Every play, it was awesome. Great vibe. If you had one word to sum up that third set, how, what what word would you choose? Fun. <laughs> yeah, it was really fun. Yeah. Uh, just the energy on the court, playing off each other's energy and supporting everyone. And it being super loud, it made it a super fun match. Absolutely. How do you kind of stay in it when, you know, set points are going back and forth, match points? How do you stay up when you're so close and then, you know, they, they come and they get a kill, they get a big block? How, how does the team stay in it in those kind of big swings that, that, that really could swing the momentum one way or another? I think just taking it one point at a time, realizing you have a job and uh, not trying to jump ahead two or three points, just saying, this point right now I'm going to do my job and get it done. Yeah. Uh, I know you're a freshman. I know you probably heard that Fresno and CBU are rivals. Does it, does it make a little sense? Do you understand how they're rivals now? Yeah, I could sense the tension here, especially with the two fan groups. It was awesome, though. It was awesome that our fans showed up and were super loud. And Yeah. yeah. I, I think this was a uh, career high for you so far in kills. You had 22. Uh, what was what was clicking for you tonight? Um, JoJo's sets were awesome. JoJo's sets were on. Uh, our passing was really great. Uh, it was definitely a team thing. Definitely. Absolutely. Awesome. Thanks so much, Lauren. Brandon Higa, uh, how would you kind of sum up that match in one word? You know, that was everything we wanted. Um, we talked before the match about things not coming easy and how in life we, people love to get things easy, mm -hmm. but rarely is anything worth achieving going to be easy. Yeah. Um, and so that, that was kind of the perfect summary of what happened. You know, we played well the first two sets. Uh, and then Fresno really responded that third set, and they did not make it easy. And mm. um, really what I wanted more than anything was for our team to come alive when things got tough. And uh, we did. We battled. We fought. And, um, you know, I give it to Fresno. We thought we had that match won about five times. Yeah. And they just kept playing and playing, and they have a great libero. Mm -hmm. uh, Gank is an un unbelievable player, and uh, Kathleen Anderson is incredible and they proved why they are all conference players they love they love the spotlight they love the battle too but so does our team yeah absolutely um can you talk a little bit about that third set i mean it was so back and forth it was so crazy what was, was it important to sweep them do you think was that oh yeah like a rivalry match yeah for sure i mean we we always want to win in three but yeah. um i think more important than Winning in three was playing another tight match. Mm -hmm. and, you know, we went one in three last weekend, but we battled. And I think uh, going through that GNAC Pac West tournament and having to play such a high level uh, every single match, mm -hmm. and being able to learn how to battle, I mean, that is what carried us through here. Mm -hmm. And the greatest thing is that the team looked comfortable out there yeah. in, a, in a tight match, in tight situations with the crowd going crazy. Um, it looked like they'd been there before, yeah. and they executed when it mattered. Mm -hmm. uh, so now you guys are on the road after being at home for the past six matches. Uh, focus change at all with like road matches? And you got a long little nor nor NorCal swing, yeah. and then you're down to Point Loma. Um, no, the focus doesn't change. Um, we just know there's a lot of things we need to get better at. Mm -hmm. And, you know, for us, it's 1% every day. We're just trying to get a little bit better every day. Mm -hmm. If we do that over time, we'll get a lot better. Um, yeah. But we always just want to take steps forward, and um, you know, going on the road is always tough, especially three matches in a row. Yeah. Um, and so, it's not going to be easy. But mm -hmm. um, you know, like I said, we don't necessarily want easy. Yeah. We want to be challenged, and uh, we want to rise to the challenge. Awesome. Thanks so much, Coach.